Hey guys, so in today's video I wanted to show you quickly how to cloak your affiliate links. So in other videos I have, I've already shown you how to use Clickbank and get those affiliate links, but they do tend to be very ugly. So what I want to show you is the way you can make them much nicer so that people are much more likely to click on those links and then go and view the offers that you want them to. So hey, just before we start, my name is Richard Diary. This is the School of Nomads. You can catch us on the theschoolofnomads.com. Please don't forget to leave a subscribe and hit that notification bell. I release videos every week discussing product demonstrations we go through product reviews and then i'll give you any tips and tricks that i'm picking up on the way and if you want to check out my number one strategy for making money online please hit the link in the description below so I just jumped over to clickbank i want to go and grab an affiliate link for us to go ahead and cloak the reason i picked clickbank just for the purpose of this demonstration is that when you go to other affiliate sites a lot of the times you have to apply for the link and it takes some time to come back in clickbank the difference is you don't have to apply for links all you need to do is provide a username and then most of these products will actually give you a link automatically just so it's quicker i'm just going to go ahead and, and grab any link if i hit promote here so i'm just going to put an old username in here and then if I did want to track this, I could put in a tracking ID, but just for the purpose of this, I'm not gonna bother. And there's my link. So I can copy that link to my clipboard, and that's the link that I would use to generate this particular product. So I'm just gonna actually show you where this link goes to. So it's just directed me to this trading center product. As you can see, that original link is pretty ugly, right? So the, the idea of this is that we're going to go and use a plugin in WordPress and make that link much more appetizing. So what you need to do if you've got a WordPress site is come down to plugins, add new, and then just type pretty in this search box here. And then you'll see one of the first results is this pretty link. So I'm gonna install that and then press activate. And then now you'll see that pretty links is on your toolbar here. So if I go in and I wanna add a new pretty link to it, there's a number of things you can do. You can do 302, 301 or 307 redirect. If you think that the link may change in time, that the affiliate link may change in time, you can put it in as a 307. If you think it's not gonna change, you can put it in as a 301. It actually doesn't make much difference because you're not gonna ask Google to index your link. All these links are for is if you wanna show people in blogs or on YouTube or areas like that, you wouldn't need to index that particular link in Google. So I just put most of mine down as 307 temporary. Then in this target URL, this is the affiliate link that you've actually got from Clickbank. So you can see that looks pretty ugly at the moment. So what it does is this pretty link here is the link that you want that to become. So my site that I'm using here happens to be something called newbornyears.com. Whatever your site name is, that's the name that will initially appear on the link. And then you just need to fill out the rest of the link. So that was, this has come to some kind of soccer product. So I'm just gonna put the word soccer there. So in the notes, if you wanted to create multiple versions of this link and post them on various sites, you could always put in your notes here when you're actually tracking them where those links are going to go so that you've got more idea of where your clicks are coming from. But just, I'm just gonna put for the purposes of this general. So this is a link I'm just gonna generally give out and then press update. So here's the pretty link. So it gives you a link title here. That's the site that it's actually gonna to go to. It's already looked at that. And here's the link that you would use. So if I copy this and then I put this into my search bar, just press enter, you'll see the actually hitting newborn year soccer. And this will actually be your affiliate link. And it goes over to this trading site. What you're actually doing when you're using something like pretty links is you're actually link shortening and then redirecting the link. So a lot of people refer to it as cloaking, but the reality is you're just gonna change it so that when the user first sees that link, they'll see a much nicer link to go ahead and click. And then it redirects to the actual link for the product. Now, a lot of search engines like Google and Bing, etc., don't like cloak link because what you're actually doing is you're completely hiding where that link goes to as well. So what I would see on here is actually be newborn years stroke soccer. So they would have no idea where that has actually took them, it would be as if that's your own website. So that's frowned on a lot of times and a lot of affiliate marketers are trying to cloak links. The reality is it's good enough just to redirect them and then they'll see this link up here, but that's not a big issue because usually then they start looking at the actual product itself and they're not really bothered about this. Plus, whenever you've got these types of links in your campaigns, it's always good to have an affiliate disclaimer underneath those links on somewhere on the page as well or on your website that actually tells people and is up front with them to say, hey, this e these are affiliate links and I get paid a certain percentage of whatever the cost of that product is. So it's always best to be honest with people. 
So I hope that was useful. This is something I'm asked all the time about how to go ahead and cloak those ugly looking affiliate links. I think Pretty Links is the best option for that if you've got a WordPress site. Very, very easy to use and also tracks your clicks. So this is that's a really good option for you. Again, don't forget to check out that link below if you're interested in a simple strategy for making money online. Please hit the like if you found this video useful and I'd love you to leave a comment below if you've got any questions or anything else you'd like me to make a video on in the future. Bye for now.